guys, welcome back to another video. It's your boy, Low Tech. I uh, hope you guys are having a great day today. Uh, if you can see, I got some new tires on the Evo. Finally, I've been needing tires, man. I've had those tires for about, what, two years now? <laughs> I've been driving like that for a while. Um, I honestly didn't even notice my tires were bad until I saw the last video I made with my buddy, uh, Colored Films. Uh, I'll put the clip up. Yeah, right there, that's when I noticed my tires are bad. Uh, I don't know if people even caught that, but I did, and it was bothering me. So that's why I wasn't really driving the Evo as much, but I am going to be driving it a lot more now because I have tires. But uh, anyways, enough about the Evo uh, 350Z. Uh, I got some new headlights for it. Let me show you. Boom! D headlights. Let's go. Can't wait to slap these on, man. Woo! Brand new. I am totally kidding. You guys are like, damn, why are you downgrading? Relax, calm down, I'm not. Um, so this is a little trick for you guys, for HR owners, or even rev up owners, because uh, it's 06 to 08 that come with the HR headlights. So if your headlights ever get hazy like this, I don't know how well you guys can see it on video, but they're pretty bad. They have like water spots. This one's even worse. Like, it is pretty bad, man. Yeah, that's been bothering me for a very long time now. And uh, I really wanna get that fixed. I, I've been fixing a lot of little things on this car because I really want it to be like perfect, in my eyes, at least. So I'm gonna be switching out those lenses and I'm adding a little something else to the headlights, but you guys will see later in the video. So the reason why my headlights are very hazy is because if you guys ever remove your lens to mod the inside of your headlights, to paint the housing or to add demon eyes or whatever, don't ever, ever wipe down the inside of the lens. There's a little very, very thin layer of film that gets easily scratched and once that gets scratched, you can't replace. So this is the reason why I bought a new lens or a new headlight so I can just get this uh so just a little FYI guys if you ever open your headlights do not wipe down the inside of your headlight because you will scratch them that's what happened to me uh, yeah so the reason I bought the headlights is just to get this lens because uh, they're cheaper because I know HR headlights are like four or five hundred bucks so you don't want to do that just get yourself some DE headlights or like 150 on Amazon. I have it in my Amazon shopping list down in the description below. You can cop some. Bought these for 150 and I'm just gonna take the lens out and I'll probably let my boy have the the DE lights. He can do whatever he wants with them. I'm gonna let him have it. And uh yeah, so I am gonna be heading over to my buddy's place so we can swap these out. So let's get to it. <laughs> Bumpers off, headlights are off. They're gonna be working on them. I am actually gonna leave my car here, come back in about two, three hours, maybe, maybe less, maybe more, don't know. And uh, we'll, I'll show you guys the before and after. I'm excited. I'm actually supposed to meet up someone to uh, buy new in intake filters because uh, these are pretty fucked. Yeah, it's time for some new ones. <laughs> up it is now a new day i left my car here overnight 
God damn. I actually like this look with no uh, eyelids. I'm going to leave it for a little bit. Oh, man. Oh, my God. What a huge difference, man. That's crazy. I don't know how well you guys can see that. <laughs> that should look so much better. Oh, I know. I just had to announce this because uh, I'm sad right now. I'm heartbroken. I lost my damn GoPro. I don't have no idea where I placed it. I must have misplaced it. I cannot find it. I looked in every car. Looked everywhere. I can't find it. I'm sad right now. So, um, I lost some footage in there that I needed to uh, continue with the vlog. So, since I don't have it, uh, I guess I'll just ask you guys since... I lost a freaking video. Uh, guess how much my Z weighs. Uh, I went to go weigh the Z, and I was pretty surprised on the on the results that I got. Pretty nice. Guess. Stop right now. Comment down below. Guess. That's all I wanted to say. I just needed to add to it because I lost it. Now I had to buy a new GoPro. Might as well just get the nine, right? Anyways, uh, back to the vlog. There it is. That's the weight. <laughs> I wonder if it makes a huge difference if I take my toolbox out. I mean, I doubt it. It's just a toolbox, but... Ah, same shit. Fuck yeah. That's how much does he weighs, guys. <laughs> 3,180 pounds. <laughs> That's fucking crazy. Toolbox didn't make a difference. So, for all you guys that go out racing, like, I have my toolbox with me. Whoop the fucking whoop. It doesn't make a big difference. Check it out. With me on it. God damn, I'm big. <laughs> I'm heavy. With me on it, it's about close to 35. But yeah, god damn. Well, anyways, that's a huge shout out to my boy uh, Rev Up Retro for hooking up the headlights. If you guys need any work, hit him up. Put the Instagram up on the screen. Uh, actually, you might be able to see him here. There's a lot of shade here. Let me roll my car back a little bit. I'm gonna have to come back here and bring my Evo so you guys can see how much that thing weighs. But yeah, check out the headlights. Looking good. Got the Demon Eyes on. Finally he fixed them for me. Demon Eyes with the Iron Man mod. That's what you call it. Looks good. I got rid of the honeycomb. So I'll put my name on there, Low Tech. Looks so sick. I'm so happy with it. I don't know, what do you guys think? Eyelids or no eyelids? I'm really, I'm really digging the no eyelids look. I told you guys earlier that I got new filters for this thing. I did. I'll show you guys when I get home. A little backstory on the intakes. Uh, I was supposed to order them like two years ago, but they stopped delivering or shipping to uh, here in California. So 
I had someone sell me them that they, I guess they had them shipped to Las Vegas and it made their car bog and it acted up uh, all weird so he didn't need them so he sold them to me uh, they're like 50 each sold to me for like 80 for both so that was a good deal shout out to him yeah finally new filters I'm gonna be slapping those on they're K&N they're about like nine inches they're pretty huge but yeah I'll be slapping that on but I'm gonna leave that for another video I'm gonna end this vlog with me washing the Z and the Evo so uh, I'll pick this up when I get home oh this looks good all right I'm about to get both cars washed um, but before we do that let's talk a little bit about the headlights so the honeycomb is cool and all but at night when you turn your lights on you don't have that much visibility because of the honeycomb because it, it blocks so much so I thought why not get rid of that just put my name something simple nothing crazy and uh, yeah I'll have more visibility at night when I turn my lights on <sighs> but other than that yeah man it looks good I'm really happy with these so again shout out to my boy Jose over at a uh, rev up retro yeah, I'm probably gonna wrap up the video here I'm gonna end it with a little montage of the headlights a little montage of the car wash and then I'll see you guys in the next video actually check out the new intake filters boom look at that big ass fucking intake filters look at that sheesh brand new can't wait to slap these on I'm gonna make like 200 horsepower more Let's go. All right, so yeah, those are the intakes. Now I'm gonna end the video. Uh, I'm gonna end it with a montage of the cars getting washed. To be good, I'll see you guys in the next video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. You guys got to see the new tires on the Evo, new headlights, new fil intake filters. Uh, you guys, you guys will see me install those in the next video, along with some other goodies for the Z. So I'm excited, man. It's good that I'm working again because now I get to do more mods for the cars for you guys and I get to create more content. So thank you guys to all you that have been patient with me. Um, the goal, every time, I never fail these motorcycles, huh? The goal this year is to boost the 350Z and I'm gonna do that. I will do that. So just be patient with me, it's, it's coming. So anyways, please give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you're not already. And guys, remember why you started.